everyone welcome to meek's channel so today we're going to be doing a pick a card reading we are going to be seeing their true feelings for you right now and picking up on their current energy so we do have three options today we're going to start with option one as um these are pumpkin rice crispy treats pumpkin pie rice crispy treats we have pile two with Welch's white grape peach. And then pile three with the Klondike bars. So if you want to pause the video and choose whichever pile you feel most called to. And I'll see you guys in a bit. Bye. Oh, this is for everyone that chose the pumpkin pie rice crispy bars. So we are going to be picking up on their true feelings for you right this moment and see what's going on with your person. So these are little Shopkins and all these little like snack things, they have like a little creature inside. So we're going to open up and see what yours looks like. Oh, look at that. How cute. <laughs> Okay, so we're going to put that right there. Alright, we're going to start off with tarot cards and see what their true feelings are for you right now. And see what's going on with your person. Okay, what are their true feelings? Okay, this may be someone you're just starting someone you just started talking to or like a crush i feel like this person gets very nervous around you we have nine of pentacles okay so they find you very beautiful or handsome and they feel like they feel a bit intimidated by you I don't know if you're well off financially or if it just seems like you have a lot going on in your life. We have five of wands. Hmm, seven of pentacles. What's going on here? Okay, for a few of you, you and your person could have recently gotten a fight or some type of disagreement. If not, let me clarify. Let's clarify the Five of Wands, please. Five of Wands. Oh, this person... Is currently feeling like there may be a lot of competition to get to you so maybe you two haven't even started talking yet or they just feel like they have to go through a lot of obstacles to get to you this person is feeling a bit disappointed because they don't feel like you'll like them or they'll be good enough for you so they are working through some self-confidence issues or they're trying to work on that <laughs> at three of cups you may hang out with a lot of people or at least this person thinks that you do but they definitely feel like you have a lot of options in life yeah, and they don't they want to get closer with you. This person does want to talk to you more. Okay, we got Justice. Someone may be a Libra. Yeah, I feel like this person wants to figure out a way to get closer to you or to talk to you more, to hang out with you more. You two may have 
had a closer relationship in the past but if not this person wants to get closer to you emotionally as well but they feel like they're at a distance from you color pink may resonate maybe someone's favorite color yeah we got the hierophant the emperor reversed and the moon reversed so there's like a difficulty of getting close to you in some aspect this may be physical or just emotionally Okay, so that's what I'm seeing for the tarot cards. Now we're going to do the love message cards and see what they are thinking, feeling, or wanting to say to you currently and what their true feelings are for you. Pile one. Yeah, I like talking to you. They want to talk to you more. Boom. Okay, we're not going to grab that one. I think about you when I'm at school, you definitely may have school with this person, or you may work with this person as well. Again, I said that you may not know this person very well. This person finds your eyes very pretty. Some of them feel like you have like a very hard exterior, but I feel like if they talk to you more or get closer to you, like you'd be really sweet and innocent. Yeah, but I hope you wait for me. Yeah, they're hoping that you'll choose them out of other options. I needed to work on abandonment issues. Yeah, again, then you just feel very scared of you not choosing them. I feel like you are keeping them as an option. Please don't give up on us. Or a few of you... Your situation may be that maybe you two are close to a breakup or maybe you're together but things are a bit rocky and this person doesn't want you to move on from them. Yeah, this person has a bad past when it comes to love. I've been cheated on before. It does their past affects their self-confidence so they just they don't feel like they're good enough for you so I'm like pumpkin spice lattes <laughs> that may be why you chose this okay you are my true love Someone's person sees that you may be talking to one other person and they feel like you may choose them instead. Yeah, there's too many obstacles to even get close to you right now. This person gets so sad when you two, like when they don't see you, when they're not talking to you. I feel like you're trying to figure out who you want. I heard last on my list, so they feel like they're last on your list of people that you'd want to be with. This could definitely be like a crush at your school, someone that has a crush on you. And yeah, they don't know what to say to you. They do want to talk. I think about us together all the time. That's for those that have had a past with this person. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> and then the last cards we have. I want to talk, but I don't know what to say. 
I have too many things going on. I need time to think. That's your energy. They feel like you just have a lot going on. Someone may be going to school and working full time. Just have a lot of things on your plate. You're kind of doing your own thing. This person's just admiring you from afar. But this person really wants to talk to you. So that's what I'm seeing for pile one. Hope that resonated for you guys. And we'll see you later. Bye. Just going to clean this up. Hello, this is for everybody that chose Pile 2 or the Welch's White Grape Peach Juice. Actually, it sounds really good. <laughs> okay, so we're going to be seeing your person's true feelings for you right now, picking up on their current energy. We're going to start with Tarot and move into the Love Message cards. So, um, if you guys don't know anything about Shopkins... Each one of these has like a little snack person thing inside, so we're going to see what yours looks like. Oh, look at that! So cute! <laughs> okay, I'm going to put that right here. You may have also felt called the pile one. Alright, so let's get into your reading. What is Pile 2's person's current feelings towards you right now? I, I heard realizing stuff. <laughs> what the fuck does that mean? <laughs> okay, the wheel reversed. <laughs> Okay, the star, we got Eight of Pentacles reverse. Oh my gosh. Okay, yeah, I feel like they're realizing maybe this connection is much more deeper or they learn some type of lesson with you or they're realizing that maybe you're the one for them. person also may be very moody. Someone could be a, a water sign or a cancer. We got five of pentacles reverse. Your true feeling towards pile two right now. Yeah, they could have been very indecisive. Maybe they couldn't make a decision on if they wanted to be with you or not. Okay, for someone I heard that they treated you like shit in the past and this person is finally realizing like oh i should have done that like i should have stayed with you and maybe not went with someone else or i just should have treated you better in the past someone likes the movie jackass or maybe this person does okay we got ace of pentacles Someone may be an earth sign. Yeah, they want things to be stable with you again. They want there to be a balance. Um, you may have definitely slept with this person. If not, this person has thought about sleeping with you. They have imagined you naked. Okay, Three of Pentacles, yeah, they could have involved you in a third party situation. Oh, for someone, this person went back and forth with you and another person.
King of Pentacles. This person also may be very focused on their money. Or they currently are very focused on their money. This person may be a little immature or acted immature in the past. They kind of have like player vibes. <laughs> um... Yeah, I see them moving moving on from how they were in the past, where they were like moody and maybe involving you with someone else. They weren't very grounded with anything. Everything, it seemed like it was up in the air and they could never make a decision on anything. So one person may have black hair or like dark brown yeah bottom of the deck we got the king of wands so they're finally making a decision that they want to be with you I feel like this person has maybe not Okay, I wanted to say not talking to you, so maybe you haven't talked to this person in a while, but I wanted to say that this person has been taking some time to themselves just to figure out what direction they want to go because the past that they've recently been dealing with with love really hasn't been making them happy and they feel like you may be like a soulmate or a twin flame or just someone very significant in their life and they are finally noticing that maybe they treated you badly. <laughs> Someone definitely may be a Leo sign as well. Yeah, the devil, they're leaving. They're moving on from the past, from any crap that they put you through. They don't want to do that to you anymore. It left them feeling more, more miserable, I heard, than anything. person never felt satisfied and it was making them very unhappy and queen of pentacles so there was like a burden between you two they're realizing that they need to get rid of this this devil card or this burden or issue to be with you okay so we're gonna see little message cards from your person so this can be what they're feeling, thinking, wanting to say, and just their current feelings for you right now. Someone's person may be a gamer or stay up really late. I heard three in the morning, or maybe the number three is significant. Yeah, I worry about us a lot. This person is definitely a worry wart. <laughs> they stay up late thinking. Someone's person may even journal or like uh, write down something, maybe poems, or seeing someone writing, writing down <laughs> songs or like lyrics for a song. This person may make music, they have dreams about you. Yeah, they feel like the bond with you is very strong. And in the beginning, they weren't sure how to handle it, so they definitely could have not handled it well <laughs> and treated you not the greatest. You're on my mind 24-7. This person sees a future with you, maybe even getting married and having kids. Seeing a vision of a house with a bunch of pictures of you and this person and your guys' kids together. So maybe they'd even wanna like settle down with you. And I feel like this person never thought that they would be like that. They always thought that they would be a player or just not really be with one person. They do have some mental health issues that they're struggling with. I do feel like it may have to do with their sleep schedule as well 
Yeah, they could have told you that they lost feelings for you, or they could have said just things that kind of hurt your feelings in the past, or maybe they even acted like they didn't have any feelings towards you. They are wondering what you think about them. If you haven't heard from them lately, they will reach out in a few weeks. They do still have a crush on you. They do still have feelings for you. Yeah, you may be separated from this person and they just want to let you know that they are going to come back to you. This isn't a forever thing. I feel like you do make them very happy. I feel like this person is ready to be in a, a real commitment with you. Yeah, they had to deal with so many toxic relationships that they didn't even know what a healthy one was until you came along. I checked my phone to see if you called or texted me. You may have them on Snapchat as well. You guys message or send each other photos on Snapchat. I'm trying to... I wanted to say I'm trying to see if I should move on or if I should go back to you. So I definitely am picking out that they are taking some time to really contemplate on what direction they want to take and how they should move forward. I do feel like they are going to decide to go back with you because again, their past has not been making them happy and they really don't feel that fulfilled with the way they were acting. Oh, a few more, okay. <laughs> I'm not gonna take that one. <laughs> yeah, this person could have said that they just wanted to be friends with you in the past or friends with benefits. They feel like this connection does intimidate them a little bit because, again, it seems like they had toxic relationships or just relationships that never lasted that long or just weren't very healthy. I feel like you're very different. <laughs> you could have felt like this person was using you in the past. Okay, for someone I heard, I'm going to use you now, so I don't know if you, I don't know who that's for. It's for like maybe one or two people that maybe you just want to sleep with this person and dump them. Okay, <laughs> that was kind of low energy or low vibrational energy. Um, you have I Just Want You. Someone's favorite animal may be a pig. Someone may also be vegan. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, this person overthinks a lot. I heard I've been through some shit, so I don't know if that's how this person feels. Or maybe you feel like this person has put you through shit. They look at your pictures all the time. Or they have a hard time trusting people. This could definitely be a water sign. And then last card, I don't trust how I feel. So that's what they're trying to work on right now. They're trying to trust their feelings. Because where they're at, they're not happy. And they definitely see a happy future with you. So that's what I'm seeing for Pile 2. Hope that resonated and I'll see you guys later. Bye. Okay, I'm gonna 
get some water and then we'll do pile three. Alrighty. This is for everybody that chose pile three or the Klondike bar. What's the saying? What would you do for a Klondike bar? No. Okay, I don't know what the fucking thing is. Maybe that was right. I don't know. <laughs> okay, so we're going to be seeing um, their true feelings for you right now and picking up on their current energy. Uh, okay, so for the Shopkins, these each have like little snack creature things inside. So let's see what yours looks like. <gasps> Look at that. What a cutie. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna put that right there and put this in the shopping cart. Okay, <laughs> so we're gonna start off with tarot to see it. your person's true feelings for you right now, their current energy. I don't know why I'm talking like this. Maybe someone has a southern accent. Okay. <laughs> Someone may also like horseback riding or wants to go horseback riding. Okay, what are Pile Three's person's current feelings for you right now? Okay, Four of Wands reversed, Two of Swords reversed. Five of Pentacles. So one may also want to travel to China or Japan, or maybe you're from there, or this person is. Uh, four of Swords reversed. Ooh, and Seven of Swords. What's going on here? Okay, please clarify. Okay, the hanged man. Okay, I feel like there may be some kind of issue with your person. Uh, maybe two aren't talking. Maybe there's... Maybe two had an argument or... Things just aren't flowing good with your person. You could have broken up with them. You two may be separated or just recently separated from each other. I see feelings right now. Okay, Ten of Cups. Okay, they're true. Let me clarify Seven of Swords, please. Seeing that your person is contemplating uh, what action to take um, for a couple of you, maybe you haven't talked to this person in a long time. Someone may be a Cancer or Water or an Air Sign. I just see that something happened up here. Um, there's some type of maybe lie or deception or maybe someone wasn't honest. Yeah, down here we got the hangman, ten of cups, eight of cups. So this person, they're like in between making a decision on if they should stay with you, if they should move on. Let me ask why. For those that are with this person, I feel like 
maybe you have recently cried over this situation, if not you, this person has. Yeah, there may be too many other people involved. What's going on here? Okay, clarify seven of swords, please. Okay, princess of wands. Yeah, so there could definitely be someone else involved. I don't know who talked to who, but maybe this person talked to someone else while you were together, or you talked to someone else while you two were together. I just feel like there's someone else involved. This is for people that know there's someone else involved. If there isn't anyone else involved, I feel like they're just trying to decide if they should um move on and find someone else or if they should give it a chance with you for those that are single and you're not dating this person i feel like this person doesn't really know what they want so that's why they're like in between making a decision they definitely could have gotten out of a bad relationship recently Yeah, your person, again, they want, they want, <laughs> I feel like I'm having a hard time wording this, um, they want a, they want new, exciting love, they want passion with someone. And they're not sure if it's with you or if they would have to go elsewhere to find this. Okay, I'm going to be honest. Someone's person has... Um, <laughs> why is this so sexual? A, a big thing? <laughs> I'll just say that. You or this person may be a fire sign as well. So what's the true feelings for you right now? Some of them are trying to figure out if they want to be independent or if they want to be in a connection. And they haven't made a choice yet. This person may be ghosting you. Yeah, if you two have gotten in a fight or a disagreement recently, this person is almost like wanting to just run away. They may have like a hard time staying and fixing things with you. That may just be how this person is where it always seems like they're just trying to run and find something different or get into a new connection because things don't work out with certain people and they're like wondering they always what the heck am I trying to say they <laughs> they want to see what else is out there they may be the type of person where they don't put much effort into things they're just very unstable or at least that's how they act or they may just be acting right now for the alchemist, they're trying to figure out if they can maybe fix something with you or if they should stay in this connection or if they should move on. So we're going to see little messages from your person. This could be what they're feeling, thinking, or wanting to say. I do feel like they're having a hard time communicating to you though. I keep messing up all my words. It's part of three's true feelings for you right now. 
Yep. I wish I could tell you what I was thinking. I really just said that. They're very much in their head. You may be separated, but they want to know that they are going to come back to you. They just need some time to figure out what direction they want to take. Yeah, this person definitely could have messed up or did something to impact this relationship in a negative way or this connection in a negative way. They can't stop thinking about you. I heard I effed up. So this person, I feel like they kind of know that they, they fucked up with you. They may also be wondering if you'll even want them back. They want a balance of give and take in the connection. Maybe they felt like they were doing more of something. I think you're cute. Yeah, they find you very cute and almost innocent. They feel like maybe they they messed up. Um, are you thinking of me because I'm thinking of you? You may have your guard up with this person now. I think about you when I'm at work. This could definitely be an ex that wants to come back as well. I regret what I said in the past. Okay, so it's really looking like this person fucked up, not you. I know we aren't talking much, but I need some time alone. Yeah, this person is thinking a lot, and I feel like they are crying when they think about you and what they did. Overthinking has been my worst enemy. Or the grass is not greener on the other side. So maybe they slept with someone. But again, that's for people that know that their person slept with someone else. <laughs> Just take what resonates for you. Okay. Yeah, this person saw a future with you. They thought about marrying you. But now they feel like they messed it all up. I feel like they messed up just with some aspect. I don't know exactly what they did. Maybe they could have just said something mean to you and now you two aren't really talking. This is so much pressure. I feel like they have to come back with an apology. Maybe they've never done that before. Or they at least they have a hard time apologizing. I saw 717. So that's, I feel like, is more of a lucky thing. So... Whatever happens with this situation, I feel like it will be beneficial for you. Um, I want to come back. I just need more time. Yeah, I do see this person coming back. This person may have been cheated on before, and this may just be a pattern that they're used to. I'm not saying it's right, but... Um, I'm waiting for the right time. Yeah, they're maybe just waiting for the right time to apologize and to reach out to you. They miss talking to you. They love talking to you. This person loves you. They may live in a different state or city. This person may come back with seeing a bouquet of flowers. To apologize and yeah, they really want to say that they love you to the moon and back they're scared to make a move towards you because they don't know exactly what you're thinking or feeling towards them right now but most of them do suspect that you're kind of pissed off <laughs> and yeah, they became obsessed with you and it scared them Maybe your person hasn't had a very deep connection with anyone else. 
or maybe a few of you this person literally may be with someone else and they may want to come back i feel like they just did something and they want to come back and apologize for it they are watching you on social media to see who's liking your posts if you're talking to anyone else or if you're still interested in them i heard they're checking to see if you're dating someone else you definitely may have watched multiple pick a card readings about this person you may also be very spiritual um yeah and then last card i'm not sure if you feel the same way so i do see them hesitating a bit because they're really not sure what you're gonna say or how you're gonna react when they do come back and apologize and if you even feel the same way towards them anymore because of what they did but that's what i'm saying for pile three hope that resonated for you guys and i'll see you later bye